Warning, this video contains scenes of animals being dispatched in the UK using legal limit air rifles. Do not watch if you may be offended. Go and watch Charlie bit my finger instead. Evening all. I'm out of my rabbit permission tonight. Finally, for the first time in quite a while. Um, as you can see, I've got something new. It's a Impact GSX. I made an after a Mark II Rapid for quite a while. Um, this came along, so this will do nicely. This was made by Impact Air Guns after the Oban went through. Um, they sort of brought out the Rapid again, the Mark II version, but with a quick fill and gauge. Um, 2 2 calibre, very nice. Shoots fantastically. Got a uh, Hug It moderator with the custom uh, end cap. So if you um, go to uh, Hug It Custom End Caps on Facebook, you can order one yourself. Uh, about £15 plus delivery, and they'll etch whatever they want on the end. And um, then you just screw it in the end of your moderator. I've also got hold of a PAR 008 LRF, very, very cheaply. Uh, so I uh, couldn't say no. So the one leaf is on the Rapid 20 cal, and the 008 is on this. Um, it's a lovely rifle. I'm using a JSB RS pellets in 2.2, which are my, still my favourite pellet in 2.2. Nice and flat shooting. I've come here tonight. There's quite a few rabbits about. I've seen a few with Mixi, including one where I drove in on the middle of the road. So the signs aren't good. But there's a few that haven't got Mixi. So uh, looks like it's just maybe starting to make its presence felt here. Uh, hopefully it won't take over because it's horrible. I managed to walk over to the one in the road and pick it up um, Just hopping around in circles in the middle of the road um, So it would have been flattened within minutes. So I brought it in and uh, Dispatched it Because it probably it was blind uh, just running around in circles It probably had a couple of days left very thin could feel its ribs and spine when I picked it up terrible really um, there we go, so see how we get on. Hopefully we'll get quite a few, thin the numbers down, They're causing quite a bit of damage again. Um, seem to have had a bit of a little explosion in population. So uh, hopefully we'll um, thin the numbers out a bit, come back quite regularly now. Um, it's a nice warm evening, there's not a lot, virtually no wind really. Um, sun's quite low, shining off to my right. So I'm going to shoot to the left, hopefully the sun will be in their eyes a bit and over that way. Gun zeroed for 40 yards. I know me hold over to 50 and hold under at 30 and 20, um, which I set to put the range. So I'll just fire a couple of test shots, make sure it's uh, bob on and then uh, see what we can do. Okay, I'm going to be on the bipod on the shooting mat. Um, it's got a bipod on it. Um, until it gets dark and then when it gets dark I'm just gonna have a, probably have a little wander uh, there's a lot of um, street light bleed here uh, from the roads around so it's very difficult to stalk and get anywhere without being spotted a mile away but I'll see what I can do I might just go and set up after dark near another warren uh, we'll have a quick look around see where they are okay we'll see how we do speak to you soon Well, it didn't take long for the first one to come out, this young one. I'd already pinged the distance, 30 yards to the target. So, half a mil dot, and it's all over. Nice straightforward shot. That's one in the bag. Just keep the focus on him, make sure it's a clean kill, which it is. Back legs give it away. A little bit later on. This one on the other side of the fence. I've got a key to the gate, so I can get through. Slip one through the wire. 20 yards, there we go. it's all over for that one always like to keep uh, 
keep an eye just to make sure they're down and stay down that's about as clean as it gets a few kicks my lights out I'm laying there for a bit longer another one makes an appearance just to the right of that first uh, that one I just did 20 yards again which is one mil dot on the pod screen a one mil dot hold under yeah no problem a nice chunky RS pellet nice clean kills just how I like it notice how it's not windy at all really which is ideal because the RS does get wafted around a bit in the wind if it is a bit breezy purely because it's lighter than your average 2-2 I thought I'd miss my chance for that one but I keep tracking him keep pinging him or her should I say it's a doe shuffle around on the bipod over to the fence through the underneath it's not a problem like I say I can get out and round notice in the background eventually there's a couple knocking about so it might be worth a stake out there one evening some good sized adults there that one on the right so ping at 41 yards which is about zero or is zero as good as it puts her head right in a nice diamond of the wire so with the slightest of holdovers just a pellet's width. Give it a squeak. Thread one through the fence. And over it goes. See the two on the left? One runs, another runs. Definitely place to go that is in the future when I get round to that bit there's a little young one near the excavation works there's a few knocking about here but they're in front of that plastic water pipe um, and I don't think they'd appreciate me putting a 5.5 millimeter hole in the water supply pipe so uh, I did leave them for a while but eventually this one made its way across with a nice safe backstop and proceeded to sit there with its head behind the metal fence so hopefully it will move its way forward which it does that's better give it a ping 26 yards hold under a tad just thread one under the fence there we go and down hole in one I didn't realise there was actually a pit uh, down below in front where they'd been digging and put a water main in I went and fished him out, it's about two foot deep it was at the end so that's five, that's not too bad Okay, it's just getting dark now, so we're uh, switching to night mode, just had those five, it's gone very quiet down there, so I've moved up about 100 yards up the site to uh, another hedge line, I've sat myself about 30 yards away, it gives me 45 degree angles either way to about 40-45 yards along the uh, hedge line, and I've set up, got night mode on, I'm ready to go. Okay, let's see if we can get a couple more before we go. Okay, as promised, did bag a couple more. 
gone well into darkness now. Got the MV on. With the infrared lamp. Nice 30 yard shot. When I remember to reload. Thirty two point five yards, which is half a mil dot between half and one. There we go. Nice and clean that one. And reload. Quick whizzy round. Any more? Oh yeah. His girlfriend. Thirty-eight, just a tad before the zero, so a, a smidgen of hold under, and it's all over. Any more for any more? Oh, another. Can I make it three out of three? 40 yards or just under 40 yards so it should be bob on but no for some reason the pellets took a bit of a swerve maybe a bit of a kink in the tail of the pellet or I don't know physics it wasn't to be I'll save him for another night but there we go, it's a lucky seven. First night out with the GSX, quite happy with that. Well, hopefully you enjoyed that little rabbit video. Be back out very soon on them. If you did enjoy it, like, subscribe and share. And until next time, take care. Bye for now.